today. I will teach you how to get infinite magic shards and huge pets in Pet Simulator 99. Before I begin, make sure to like this video and subscribe with the bell turned on so you don't miss out on any of my future videos. Also, if you have over 1,350 stars and want to join a max level clan that is top 50 on the leaderboard, we are recruiting. There is no minimum gem requirement at the time of the clan battle. And I mean, you're basically guaranteed a super rare limited edition booth. All right, guys. Now, many people have already covered this method. However, their videos are rather challenging to understand. So I will put my spin on things and make it super straightforward and easy. That way, all of you guys could get infinite huges and infinite magic shards while literally doing nothing, except for spending five minutes to watch this video. Ah! All right, guys. So the requirements are a laptop or a desktop that runs Windows. You will need an application called Auto Hotkey, which I will show you how to get and set up. Up. Wow, what a beautiful cast. Did you guys just see that? Um, you will also need a pacement script, but everything will be linked in the description below in chronological order so that it's super easy to follow and understand. Step one, auto hockey. Okay, guys, so for this step, you want to go ahead and click the first link in the description labeled as step one and auto hockey, respectively. This will bring you to the auto hockey page. From here, just click download, then click version 1.1, install the app. From this point on, all you need to do is set up the app, then launch it. Once you have launched Auto Hotkey, it should bring you up with a menu similar to this. And this is where we get into step two, setting up Auto Hotkey. There are two very important things that you will need to learn in Auto Hotkey, which are super straightforward to understand. Also, it is very important you download version 1.1 and not 2.0 as for the version 2.0 does not work with the current auto phishing method. Anyways, let's go ahead and learn to navigate around auto hotkey. You guys will only need to use two buttons. Firstly, you wanna go ahead and use Windows Spy. And for now, you wanna go ahead and put it aside if you have two monitors or just minimize it. Um, I have two monitors, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it to the side. And it's pretty simple. I will go ahead and explain why you need Windows Spy in step three. The second thing you will need to learn is the new script button. Now, when you click it, a new script window pops up. You wanna go ahead, title your script, whatever you want, and then click edit. Now, you should have two things open on your computer aside from the auto hotkey, the Roblox, and whatever else you might have. Two things from auto hotkey, Windows Spy, and the notepad, which is actually your script. This is a macro, but it's called a script, so I will be referring to it as a script. However, this is a macro, and it is complete, and it is completely within TOS. Now, guys, for ease of access later, you want to go over and navigate into your file explorer, go to your documents, and Create a shortcut for auto hotkey by right clicking on it and clicking create shortcut. Um, it is the same process in Windows 11. However, I use Windows 10. Um, you want to go ahead and put that shortcut on your desktop somewhere. That way it's way, way, way easier to access in the future as you don't need the app itself. For step three, you will need to go ahead and follow the second link named step three or and paste bin in the description. And once you're over at paste bin, you want to copy these 21 lines of code. What do you do with these lines of code? Remember how we have our notepad open. You want to go ahead and paste those 21 lines of code and you are almost there. Congratulations. Next, you want to go into your game. Make sure your game is set to your desired resolution. Mine is in full screen and I use 1920 by 1080 resolution. So 1080p. And this is the desired resolution for how I want to be AFK. Once that is said and done, you will need to go ahead and utilize your Windows Spy for Auto Hotkey. And here is where you will need to jot down two values temporarily. As you guys see right here, there is a tab for mouse position and it says screen and then it shows you these two numbers. The first number is your X value and your second number is your Y value. You just wanna go ahead and Cast your rod into the ocean, and then you want to get to the very, very top of this white piece on the bar, which is where your bar will fill up um, in order to reel the fish in. Now, for me, it is roughly about 1488 and 212. So I will go ahead and hover back into the notepad script, and I will change these values accordingly. So 1488 and 
two. These are the only values you need to change and then you are done. After you change those two values, these values don't really matter. You wanna go ahead, click Control S on your keyboard or go to file and then click save or save as depending what you want to do but control s does the trick then you want to navigate into your document auto hotkey folder you want to open your auto phishing script by double clicking on it that window should not pop up for you but for me it was already running you want to make sure you don't have a fish to reel in and the last thing you will want to do is to click f1 on your keyboard then it will automatically fish for you and tap for you. Like, look guys, I'm clapping right now and it's literally tapping for me. This is an anti-AFK method and this works perfectly. And that was it guys. Was it really that hard? I don't think so, but thank you all so much for watching. From this method, you should get roughly 25 magic shards an hour or about 600 magic shards or more a day, depending on your luck. There's also a permanent chance of hatching a huge Poseidon Corgi, which is worth very much gems and in the advanced dig site, the odds are super buffed. However, this works for any dig site and it is a great way to get better rods as well until you get to the last rod, which should be actually really fast. You should be able to get to the max rod in literally one day, guys. Also, once again, consider subscribing. And if you made it this far, comment 100 to show your support for me as an up and coming Roblox Pet Simulator creator and maybe tag big games into this and tell them to partner me. Or actually, maybe not this video as this is very borderline TOS breaking. However, it's still within TOS and... Cause I'm feeling like I'm running and I'm feeling like I gotta get away, get away, get away. Better know that I don't and I won't ever stop. Cause you know I gotta win every day, day.